Okay, so this we are at the main concourse, right? Of of the football stadium. Yeah, we have a, there's a trainers. Trainer room. Okay. And then, yeah, the first floor you walk right out into the football facility. Do you think eventually, like your wrestling room will come over here, or like what what's? No, I I see our wrestling room staying over there. It's, yeah, it's where our duel. Like you walk out of our duel. Uh, so this is the concourse yeah. for the football stadium, dude. This is big. Oh, yeah. I thought it was like it's packed on game days. It's crazy. Oh, that's my favorite concession right there. Oh, yeah. So we come out. And it's early. We don't. I don't think we realize how early it is. Yeah, still, it's got a little lighter out. So this is built literally into the side of a mountain. That's a mountain right next to us. Your press box is massive. Oh, look at the end, the end zone suite. Sick, dude. That's all new. So they added all that. Sweet. Got the locker rooms in there for our football. Everything. That's the visitors. Visitors, yep. And then there's your scoreboard. Is there any seating on that scoreboard side or not? So that whole side of it is a hill. It's called Miller's Hill. Hmm. And that's at, that's path. That's so path. Miller's Hill is like a like a general admission. It's like you go to a concert. Gotcha. That's crazy. So your capacity goes up because you can put more people. Have you ever seen the fluctuating capacity on some of these stadiums? It's crazy. Like Michigan. Our first game, our first home game was sold out. And that was probably a little bit over 35,000. Then our second home game was on a third day at 28,000. Yeah, so that's a mountain. This is built into the side of a mountain too. I mean, you are the Mountaineers, yeah? Yep. Or as or as uh, Dolph Ziggler, Nick Namath calls them, the flaming old guys. Oh, yeah. Was it Yusuf? Is that the Yusuf? Yusuf's yep. the, Yos Yosef's for Yusuf? Yosef. Yep. Okay, so he's the guy. You were going to bring these guys out here and give them a little torture, weren't you, today? Yeah, we usually do after every lift. We'll come run here or run, run some steps. It's pretty easy to find incline here. <laughs> run. You think? <laughs> Listen, I'm just got to put it out there. He, I, what is that's not Pennsylvania, right? Must be physician's assistant. That must be what that is. I don't know what the PA is. The PA's got me thrown off. Yeah, that's all. This press box is massive, dude. So this is Rick's. Your actual facility is Rick's. Rick's Our, Athletic yeah, Complex, right? Athletic, and then right. this is Kid Brewer Stadium. Yes. This is sweet, man. I like it. I really like it. Yeah, we gotta get this is only thirty thousand. Feels so much bigger than that. We got so all this right here, this whole stands like these four sections, all students. All and students. It's packed. Like pretty much that's a nice thing, like it's right on campus, students get here easy. What is the when the they dorms. go when they go wrestle today? Like when when should they when do you guys I know that you're not running practice should I get that, but what, when will they be in there? And when do the cat? When's John? John John sounds like he, you know, he wants it. He told me yeah. because we say it, they better be there, right? Right. What will they be in there for? What, what do you think he'll put them through? Well, John John, I mean, it's kind of on their own today. So our guys, we're big on like they need, they need to know how to put themselves to a workout. So they'll come in and they'll probably drill for a little bit and then get some live in. But each guy is gonna kind of do something different. If one guy wants to work on bottom, it'll work on bottom. So will they go any live? Oh, yeah, there'll be a lot of Because it's a fall break. Yeah. They get, like, a big recovery. They get, like, a four-day recovery. Yeah, so we won't start back up. Uh, you know, we could start official practice on October 10th. That's, like... Next week. Wednesday, you can... And so, it's the official, right, for everybody, most everybody. But right. is anybody going to go on October 10th, do you think? I don't... I mean, that's on them. You, go, you can only worry about what's going on here. The craziest part is, like, this year felt so much faster because we didn't start official season, I think, official practice till like, mid-November, end of November last year gotcha. because of COVID. Yeah. But this year we're starting October 10th, and our first our first tournament is the Open, uh, the Virginia Tech Open, the Hokie Open in, uh, in November. So wow. we're, we're less than a month out. That's crazy. They got to be ready to go. I love that lung burning in the first – your first competition, that lung burn. You remember that first? Yeah. You, remember that first match, that lung burn. First couple, man. Oh, it's crazy, isn't it? I remember Michigan State lung burn, all day long. Dude, this is awesome. Come on, let's go down and get. I want to go watch some wrestling. Your offices are here, though. Yep. Yep. 
soon to be on the sixth floor. Okay, so you're moving. You are moving, Coach John Mark. Moving up. And where is Coach John Mark today? He's down in Atlanta. Is he recruiting? Uh, I think he's meeting with some guys. Gotcha. Down in Atlanta. Okay. Donors or something. So here we go. This is this is not for everybody. Not everybody just gets to enter this part of this facility. Like you're you're coding in right now. Yeah. And each of our guys will have a code. Okay, coding in, and then we're right back at it. Athletic training, and then we're gonna go right up to, uh, right up to, what were we on, fourth level? Yep, fourth floor. Let's get it. 